Wow. Just finished up an hour and 25 minute cardio session pushing a push mower cutting grass. It's a win-win. You get the grass cut and you get some cardio in. So hour and a half walks yesterday. The grass, we've had thunderstorms and rains, heavy rains for three days. So the grass was super thick like carpet. And it was also very wet. So it, put a, it added 10 minutes to my normal time because of having to dig in really, you know, I mean, where the areas were really, 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 really thick and wet. I had to dig in to get over those. But I love that I'm 64 and I can still cut grass. I can go, I can cut this whole yard, which is a little over half an acre. I can cut that myself in one day if I want. But I've been using it as a cardio session. I split it in two now. So anyway, I got an hour and 25 minutes done on cardio today, and yesterday I walked an hour on my walking pad in the living room watching TV, and tomorrow I'm going to walk, and then I'm going to add 500 reps, 100 at a time, 5 sets of 100, stiff leg deads, RDLs, whatever you want to call them, Romanian deadlifts, dumbbells, and then bend over and do a set of 100. I'm going to have 20-pound dumbbells in each hand, which is an additional 40 pounds and do 100 reps squeezing glutes as I go up. That'll be five sets of those, and I will show tomorrow real quick what I'm talking about in case I've confused you, which I tend to do sometimes when I'm, my mind is racing and I'm after a, cutting this grass. Whew. Anyway, I got that done. Doji's feeling better. His teeth, he's are doing good, so he's all right there. He didn't break his jaw when he hit whatever it was he hit with that blood all over his face. Anyway, he's doing well. He's still on his pain meds and antibiotics and will be for a little bit. But Okay, so that's all that's going on here. I'll talk to you soon. Um, I'm getting ready to get some stuff ready for the water park and theme park that we're going to be doing on Monday and Tuesday. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's in Valdosta and it's huge. And it's only like 38 minutes from our front door. So how cool is that to be able to do a, a mini vacay where you can stay in your own home. You don't have to put the dogs up and board them. You don't have to travel far for it. You can eat right there. You have all kinds of rides and exciting uh, shows and all kinds of stuff to do. And I'll be videoing a lot of that and sharing with you what, what we find when we're there. So you guys take care. We'll talk to you soon.